Ensuring your horse does not become overweight is essential for preventing laminitis. Fatty tissue is hormonally active and by mechanisms which are not yet fully understood is linked with insulin resistance. The increased load on the feet, which comes from being overweight, also increases the weight carried by the lamini. This pony shows some classic symptoms of insulin resistance with excessive visible fat deposition on her crest, tail head and over her ribs. Exercise is important providing there is no active laminitis. It will aid weight loss and improve insulin sensitivity. Some simple checks can be made on a regular basis which can help with early identification of laminitis. Firstly, walking a short distance on hard ground, especially with some tight turns, can highlight mild foot soreness which might have otherwise gone undetected for those only walking on soft surfaces. Getting used to feeling digital pulses and what is normal or abnormal is helpful. Digital pulses should be felt at or below the level of the fetlock and in a normal horse or pony they're usually faint and difficult to detect. For those with signs of laminitis a more obvious bounding pulse is palpable. Keeping a close eye on any regional fat pads can give you early warning signs. An increase in any of these fat deposits or hardening of the crest can indicate imminent laminitis. <laughs>